guys, this is Chaos Fireball Work here again. And today I'm gonna be reacting to top ten screamers and top ten drummers. Mm-hmm. All from, you know, metal metal bands. You know, screamers are like, you know, from like death metal bands, you know. Uh I should have said, you know, something like I'm reacting to the top ten screamers. Those I don't know. Anyway, yeah, I'm reacting to top 10 screamers and top 10 drummers, you know. I do have a favorite screamer, but I have a feeling, sometimes I have a feeling that, um, for this list, um, for this top 10 list, I think that Mitch Lucker, the singer from Suicide Silence, um, is going to be in this list, like, number one, I think. Um, he's my favorite screamer. I mean, he's pretty much the only screamer I ever know. But, um... <clears throat> I know there's other there's others out there that I don't know that are on this list. Um, I feel like I've seen this video before. I, I haven't really seen it, but I clicked. I remember clicking on the video one time, and I like. <coughs> uh, I remember uh, seeing a little like. I just like skipped to random parts and hoping I could find something interesting like Mitch Lucker or something like that from Suicide Silence. But sadly, you know, he died. He died like four years ago. This sucks. But they have a new singer now. I mean, it feels like they didn't really care about him because, like, two years later they replaced him because that's it's so disrespectful, you know. It feels like they didn't really care about the, like, they didn't really care about him that much. I mean, they cared about his family and all that. I mean, since, since you know he died. But, yep. So, here we go. This has a lot of dislikes, by the way. I don't know why. So it would be corn. I heard of this band. Asking Alexandra, I know this one. I know Asking Alexandra. But I don't know who, who their lead singer was. I feel like this, sh this list should be like going faster since, you know, they're just going through each one individually. But, you know, I think they can make it faster. I mean, it's 10 minutes long, and I can only record, like, 10 minute lim limit, and then just record another 10 minutes. So, that's... That sucks. I can't record unlimited. What's up next? Oh, yeah, Chester Bennington from Lincoln Park. I don't think Chester can scream anymore because I've seen I've seen some of their recent stuff like their uh, their recent live shows that they do now and Chester can't really scream anymore he he just mostly yells now because he can't really scream anymore I mean he's he's giving it his all he's trying but I don't hear any like s screaming. But, yeah, it's... 
I'm probably going to have to talk over this a lot since, uh, you know, it's... Lincoln Park is really big, and I'm sure there's a lot of big bands on this list, but because I have to get more commentary since, you know, copyright. Strike my ass down. <coughs> Lincoln Park is actually just really good. I don't listen to them as much anymore, but they're really talented. They're really good. Oh, of course, Slipknot. Can't go through a top 10 screamers list if that's Corey Taylor. I want to listen to it so bad, but yet I have to give so much commentary since... Um, too much, you know... These are big bands, so I don't want to... Um... You know, give too much away and just, you know... Get myself in trouble for copyright. Mitch Lucker, yeah. I told you guys, I knew Suicide Silence. Pantera. Classic metal. It's up there with Metallica and Megadeth. Really, really curious to see what number one is all about. Matt Shadows and Vince Sembold. Vince Sembold. I don't mean to sound like that. It sounds wrong because it sounds. I sound like a rapper. Right? Pretty retarded, I know. I grew up with Avenge Sevenfold. It sucks that their drummer had to die. Well, he didn't have to die, he just died. And I don't remember how. Sounds like a pretty sour scream there. Looks like his voice was about to crack and, you know, give out at that moment. I always wanted to drum kit. Davy Havel. I don't know this one. This is the only one on this list that I don't know. AF. I think AFI must stand for something. I mean, I can't. I don't. I don't know if it's it's AFI stands for something. Like the band name is just too long that they just cut it short to AFI, or it's just AFI, just like the band. I really don't know anything about this band. I was expecting something else, but you know, this is a really good list. I like that.
set it. There's two more minutes left. Where are the other two minutes? Why is there like two... I don't even know. There's like two more minutes of just nothing but a blank screen. But yeah, up, up next is uh, <coughs> Top 10 Drummers. I don't know if I can record. I don't know if I can record tonight. Since, you know, I gotta go to bed soon, I, you know. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if I can record tonight. I think I might have, I might have to record the top ten drummers tomorrow. Since, you know, it's getting pretty late now, so I don't, you know, I, I gotta, you know. Yeah. I guess I'll see you guys later. Alright, I apologize. I think I might be able to record tonight. Um, it's getting pretty late. This is like 11 minutes long, so it's the last one, so I don't really want to skip want to skip it and just like wait tomorrow to watch to watch it or something like that. So I'm just gonna get this out of the way. I'm just gonna do it right now. So fuck it. I mean, this this reaction video has been pretty like I don't know, like just really kind of awkward. I don't because I I usually don't react to this type of stuff like metal music or anything like that. I mean, it's, I, I usually react to, like, funny stuff like Vine compilations and, you know, um, stuff like that. I used to react to Filthy Frank, though. I don't really like Filthy Frank, because, you know, negative things, only negative things came from those things, and I didn't really like them. So, and, yeah. But I don't know. It's it's been pretty awkward since, since I never really reacted to this before, though. I, I have something, I have reacted to something metal related in the past but you know I haven't reacted to like top 10 screamers or top 10 drummers but this is pretty cool but what I don't understand is why does I have like 2,000 dislikes I mean two and two and a half thousand I mean I really don't know how why it has so many dislikes I don't know if they're not like like giving people like the best screamer or best drummer or something like that and and it's not on it's not on the list, and they wanted it to be on the top ten list, but it didn't make it. So they're probably disappointed, and they're just like you know disliking it. They didn't like it, so I I, I don't know. But we'll have to find out. Este video es una opinión personal que proviene de mis gustos musicales. No estoy menospreciando a otros grandes bateristas que no aparecerán en este conteo, ni mucho menos estoy comparando qué banda es mejor que la otra. Solo es un top 10, en mi opinión, de los bateristas que más me gusta escuchar, y así se los comparto. <tose> Jason Bald, Abs Wound. <coughs> that guy looks really familiar. I think I've seen him somewhere. I think I've seen him from a band called Get Scared. I mean, I, I've listened to the Get Scared. I've, I've listened to some of their material. That guy looks really familiar. I'm sure he's not the drummer from Get Scared or anything. I, I mean, I'm pretty sure... I don't know. I always wanted to get my hands on a real drum set and play actual drums and just jam out to like my favorite songs, like, you know, the some of the heaviest stuff. I feel like I know that drum beat. Back Black Veil Brides. Why is the volume so low? I 
I have a feeling Joey Joris is going to be on this. Or probably number one is going to be John Bottom or something like that. One of the old classic drummers. I feel like Joey Jorison is bound to be on this list because... Asking Alexandria again. I feel like I should listen to Asking Alexandra. They seem like a pretty interesting band. Modern Day Escape. <coughs> it's pretty badass drumming right there. I can never do that. I'm, I could be a fast drummer, but I can't be as fast as him. I mean, I've, some, I've seen some really fast drummers. I probably need a lot of practice to like, you know, be a professional drummer, just like really, really fast, just like that. <coughs> I've been coughing a lot. I've been sick for a while, so... Sounds really awesome. Bullet for my Valentine. best drummers of our generation. Avenged Sevenfold brings back a whole lot of memories. You can never forget them. Expecting like another drummer. Wait, wait, hold on. Is that the new singer from Avenged Sevenfold? I think that is. Because I saw a picture that came up that showed uh, him holding up an Avenged Sevenfold poster or picture. So I think this guy might be the new Avenged Sevenfold drummer. I don't really know who he. I don't know. 
I don't really know his name or I don't I don't even know who he, what he looks like. So I guess this, this could be him. This could be the new drummer. <coughs> this guy is good, but I'll, I don't think he'll ever beat the rev. I like this Metallica. I really like the uh, I really like the sound of a drum kit, just like you know, just like drum solos, like with the snare drum, the toms, the bass, and all the cymbals. I mean, it just it makes me want to drum. I mean, it just makes me want to have my own drum set. I knew it. Joey Jordison. Can't leave him out of anything. Especially on... Oh, he's number one. A lot of people are haters and say that Joey Jordison isn't the best drummer in the world. He's not the fastest. I mean, I know he's, he's really, really fast. I mean, look at that. There's other faster, there's faster drummers too, Fast, faster than Joey Jordison. Some people say, oh, Joey Jordison, Joey Jordison doesn't have any groove and he's, he's not, you know, Slipknot needs a drummer and not a faggot. I mean, Joey Jordison did really well. I mean, their new drummer is alright, but he'll, he'll never top Joey Jordison, like, ever. There's some people that you just can't replace in bands. I mean, they're amazing. You can't, you can't replace someone that has more talent than the person who has replaced. But, damn, that's fast. But what do you expect? It's Joy Doris himself. Make me want to play my, uh, play that, that little tiny drum set that I have right next to my desk. It's like a little mini tiny drum set that I use. I hardly ever use it anymore. I, I got it, like, in the summer. Like, summer. You know. That was the top 10 screamers and top 10 drummers. And like I said before, I love metal. I really love metal. Hard rock, I, I like hard rock. It's it's all right, but you know, like heavy metal can like really top hard rock. I mean, hard rock can be like, you know, heavy at times, but you know, the drums aren't really that fast. I mean, sometimes in live performances, hard rock drummers can like, you know, modern hard rock drummers can like uh, do really fast dr drum solos. You know, because, you know, they're talented, you know. But, you know, metal drummers like Joey Jordison and, like, Metallica drummer, I mean, I, f I forget Metallica drummer's name, I'm sorry. Uh, they they can really, you know, do better than hard rock drummers. I mean, or maybe they can, like, do both, like, equally or something like that. I guess this, I don't know, I, I don't usually do this kind of stuff. Like, to be honest, I don't really usually do this. But uh, I feel like I should like, hold on one second.
is my mini drum kit. I got this like a year ago. Not a year ago, but like beginning of the of the summer like this year, earlier this year. <laughs> I don't feel like I really want to go on too long because I don't want to look like, you know, you know, I just, I feel like I want to, I really want to do this. I mean, drumming is so fun. Like, I, I could, like, literally do this, like, for the last 10 minutes, sorry, last 10 minutes of the video. This is Phil Collins. I don't care anymore. Just a small cover of that. But yeah, I don't want to go on. I don't want this to go on too long because you know it's late at night right now, and I don't really want to do it for too long or anything. But yeah, that really made me really want to play uh, some, it really made me want to play drums. I mean, it made me eager to play drums. Every time I see someone, every time I see a drummer, or every time I want, every time I see like a drummer like on his drum set, like just playing really fast, like just doing a, like a really fast drum roll, or just like, you know, just going all out, just going crazy on, on the drum set, and just, you know, it, it makes you want to. It, w it makes you want to play drums, so that's 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 just why I did that. Though I don't usually do that kind of stuff. I never really do that kind of stuff. I did that before, but you know, not not too much. But yeah, please like, comment, favorite, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. And I'll see you guys later. And bye. <laughs>